Okay, I'm at my next location. This place is for sale. It's got a big for sale sign outside. And it's heavily overgrown. So basically, we're just going to do... First, I'm going to start off back here because... Oh, wow. I like the shingles up there. They're sharp. Those are like... Uh... I might be wrong, but maybe Australian, maybe. Uh, this place is gonna, it's pretty small, so it's really not that much to it. And I'm definitely not trying that door. Could have an alarm, maybe. You got a shed over here. And it's a cash door. There is a lot of abandoned buildings on Crown Road, but up that way, I would have to have somebody with me because it's not safe enough. It's totally not safe enough. It's like uh, gang graffiti tag everywhere. So like I said, I can't do every single place. There it is for sale. Unless I don't care about my own well-being, that'd be the only reason why I could do every place. Sharp. Let me see if I can get over here. It's pretty, it's pretty clean. Yeah. You can see that over there. Counter. bright and yellow today <laughs> I love this shirt <laughs> all right so I'm probably not gonna get eight minutes out of this video for sure but some of them as long as I can get some of them to eight minutes maybe ten minutes you know that'd be pretty cool but All I can see is my own reflection. It's a cash store. And Let's see what they got this way. it for that I'm gonna just show you how the front of it looks I used to live right in that uh, apartment that apartment building place right there I used to live in number 15 I believe and oh my god it was a nightmare And uh, yeah, I used to live right over there, probably about 2013, 2014. And there you go, you got your uh, inner sign right here. And that's another thing. I hate doing stuff like this in uh I hate doing stuff like this in busy areas because you kind of put a lot of tension on yourself. But see if I can find those areas that secluded, they would have to be good areas because if they're too bad, I put myself in great danger, you know. Because you know, this is 2022 and it's crazy, so sorry if that one wasn't too long, but I guess I can just add this one to the 
video I'm getting ready to do on the this cinema, this this uh, cinema building. Jeez. I ain't got my purse. I got my license. I might as well just grab the other part and just keep that in the freaking car. Go get that. Month. Oh my god, there were like uh, centipedes like uh, coming out of the walls. Shit, I can't. This street is so busy, it's like I can't even. The street is so busy. I'm having a hard time getting out of here. But um, there were centipedes like everywhere. Like, I had to. Oh my god, it was. And I'm so scared of those things. I had a hard time in there. I was pretty young then, like uh, 2012. I had to be about early 20s. So <laughs> it was it was pretty bad. But I got out of there after after that. I was in a homeless shelter. And um, that didn't last that long. It was a woman's shelter. I was the first transgender accepted there. And basically, some girl tried to fight me there. And they kicked me out instead. And, you know, we didn't actually fight or nothing, but she was trying to fight me. And they just didn't, couldn't accept that, I, you know. It's like they let me in, they accepted me, but then they fucking booted me out because obviously they wanted to change their mind. You know, so. It's just a little backstory. And there's so many, there's so many f fucked up things that happen. Like, so, anyway, let's get to the place.